You may be expecting someone to introduce me, but I'm not like all the other guys. So, let me introduce myself. I'm Narco, top one player in the world for several seasons. And I'm risking my life teaching you how to become a pro player in a matter of days, giving you the most valuable tips and tricks you'll ever find. Sit down, relax, and enjoy. Let's say you're in a difficult situation and you think that crouching into a corner while waiting for the danger to go away will save you at that very moment. But you're not quite right. If you crouch but still turn left or right for any reason, your footsteps can be heard by your enemies. And then you better start making plans on what to do next, like sitting on the next revival flight. The enemy I knocked down a few seconds ago just died. Now, pay attention because you'll hear some footsteps in a few moments. Did you hear that? I don't know exactly where he is, but I know he is somewhere close. So I've decided to make him come out right away. No, to be honest, that was a nice scream. Two crates in here. That means that little prink was hiding in here. And the only way to sit behind this thing and not to be seen is if you stay crouched. Now, if you want to crouch but not be detected, but at the same time want to see what's going on around you, just use your little eye icon you have on your screen. Tap and drag the icon on the screen to see what you are looking for without making any noise. Have you ever wanted to throw a grenade through a small narrowed window, but never quite got it right? <laughs> I feel you, mate. It happened a lot to me. Whenever you want to do that, switch from TPP to FPP to see more clearly the trajectory of your grenade. And believe me, you'll have no more problems throwing grenades. If you ever want to land on a house roof, this is the type and format that you want to look for, the T format. If you know how to use it, you have 360 degrees protection. As you can see, that little mosquito stopped in there quite suddenly. I don't know if he has superpowers to see through these walls and that I'm in here, 
but I don't want to risk it. And for that reason, I'm using this slide around the corner technique, because he's aiming at me. He expects me to come out and shoot him from here, but with the slide, I'll come out much farther away than he expects me to. Another example in here... Another in here... And another in here. If you ever have to choose between a full level 2 or 3 vest and 100 HP or 150 HP and a very badly damaged vest, go for the first option. In most of the cases, if you don't have a vest, you will die within 4 to 5 bullets with 150 HP. But having a full vest on you, you can extend that up to 6 bullets or more, depending on the distance. Even if you only have 100 HP, one bullet can make all the difference. And a quick tip for all those among us who love to kill this ugly zombie from the farm. If you carry an extended mag with you, switch it to the weapon which gives you more bullet capacity for a faster kill. And once you're done with that, don't forget to switch it back on your main weapon. And if you want to see more tips and tricks, war strategies and awareness inside the battlefield, visit the YouTube channel of one of my students, Cod Bougie. Soldiers, my mission ends here. After all this speech, I would appreciate if you buy me a drink. Link on the description. Also, if you want to come with me on the battlefield, join my Discord server. And don't forget, for a daily live stream and giveaways, follow me on Trovo as well. I was Narco, number one in the world for several seasons. Let me know if you have enjoyed my tips and tricks to bring you more. Cheers, mate.